Welcome back, everyone. I've been joined by Mama Pat Butler, and she's going to tell us about an upcoming jazz event that's happening at her church. Yes. Mama Pat, it's a pleasure to meet you. Thank you so much for coming on the program. Oh, thank you for having me. Anytime. Thank Please you. tell us about the event. Well, the event that we're having at Mother African Union Church is being is our second annual jazz and music event. We had our last uh, first one last year, and it was called the a Jazz Matinee, and we did. Uh, you know, a profile on the old baby grand. And it was a wonderful, wonderful success. And we really want to make this an annual event. So what we're doing is, uh, this year we're doing uh, an event and it's called Swinging on the Chitlin Circuit. Now a lot of people, they kind of smile when we say Chitlin Circuit, but for some of the people, uh, the older generations, I'll say 1950s, you know, beyond, they know what the Chitlin Circuit is. The Chitlin Circuit is where uh, a, a string of clubs along the East Coast and the Southern states where uh, before uh, desegregation, integration. And um, we didn't have any place to perform. So we got a bus and the band, loaded up the band and the comedian and the dancer and wonderful singers and they did a, a, a number of one night stands. They go to one club and do it, then they get on the bus and go to another one and do another wonderful show. And there were a lot of people that had their whole career on the Chitlin circuit. And you know, all the greats, Sarah Vaughan, Ella Fitzgeralds, you know, Billie Holiday, the Duke Ellingtons and all those, they, they played the, uh, the Chitlin circuit. So we thought that we would, in addition to entertaining people and introducing it, uh, we would also give you a little history. And um, we know that we are going to have a great, great time. So what can people expect? Well, when you come, um, uh, we're actually going to have a bus. <laughs> We're gonna have a bus and people are gonna load up and get off of it and then they're gonna hear some great music. One thing about the Chitlin Circuit is that it wasn't just one type of music. You could get blues, you could get jazz, you could get rhythm and blues, you could get a little bit of gospel, and even some rock and roll there, I'm telling you. Well, right now they have <coughs> that, that um your event flyer up, yes, and I want to just yes. read it really quick while we have it up before we take it down. Sponsored mm -hmm. by the Peter Spencer Family Life Foundation, Swinging on the Chitlin Circuit, the second jazz and music event will be held April 30th, 2011 at 4 p.m. at the historic Mother African Union Church. And the address is kind of cut off there, but it's 8 812, 812. North Franklin okay. Street. Yes. And how can people get tickets and how much are tickets? Well, the tickets are $20 per person and they're $35 a couple. And you can call uh, the church office, 652-9937. Or you can also call uh, Reverend Mike Jones, and his number is 743-9184. Now, how did you find, what? who are the musici musicians and the artists that are going to be featured? Well, you know, we have a number of uh, Wilmington music uh, musicians that are going to be the house band. That's what we're going to call them, the house band. Um, I don't know all of the musicians' names, you know, right mm -hmm. off the top of my head. I do know that we are going to be um, uh, highlighting um, for those people in the audience who are familiar with Mr. Um, Ronnie Smith, who is a wonderful uh, musician. We're going to be highlighting him playing the harmonica, all right, and um, he's going to be doing some some things, you know, back in the day. A lot of blues. Uh, we have Baba Kamal and Goon, who's also going to be a part of it. And we just have some wonderful, wonderful musicians. Now, I have to be honest with you, I'm not the one that gets the musicians. Okay. Uh, Reverend Mike Jones is the one that really gets the musicians. But in addition to the musicians, we're going to have wonderful, wonderful music. We're going to be featuring uh, some of the music that we'll be featuring is uh, the music of B.B. B. B. King, uh, the legendary Sam Cooke, Otis Redding, Mahalia Jackson, That's Bobby wonderful. Blue Bland. We'll be doing uh, Martha and the Vandellas, <laughs> you know, some Supremes, and even some Divas, <laughs> Tina Turner. Oh, they got to come in here. Tina Turner uh, when uh, she's gonna be singing "Proud Mary" and and. Uh, Billy, Billy Holiday. We are going to have a ball. We are going to have a ball. So this is the second annual, the second time that you've yes. done it. What prompted the first time? Where did the need and the desire come from? 
Well, actually, um, for those of you who know me, Mama Pat, I'm a member of Mother African Union Church, and we consider ourselves the History Church. Uh, we are the ones that um, uh, do the August quarterly every year, and the Peter Spencer Family Life Foundation is the 501c3 component of Mother African Union Church, and we have a wonderful, wonderful museum there. It's called the Peter Spencer Heritage Hallway, and under that is another component that we uh, do. It's called the Serenity uh, Gathering Place Cafe, and what we do is we present artists, spoken word mm -hmm. artists, singers, musicians, you know, visual artists, you know, every so many months we have this. And Reverend Mike Jones had come to me and said, well, I really like to do a jazz. And so we started working on it. It was successful. But the need not only to get out that we could present to the community uh, historical kind of information, but also we have a wonderful, wonderful um, summer camp. It's called the Kwanzaa Summer Camp. And the camp is actually based on the principles of the Kwanzaa holiday. So all of the activities, it's not a recreational camp, but we do have a lot of recreation. And um, it's a culture and history camp. We take lots of trips. We learn lots of history. Uh, this year we're going to be doing um, a study on Dunley because uh, all, I don't know whether anybody knows out there or not, but all of the streets in Dunleaf, which is one of the oldest African American communities in, um, in Delaware, um, all the streets are named after famous African Americans. That's right. Yes. So we're, oh, isn't that <laughs> yes. wonderful? So we're going to actually use Dunleaf and the names of the street as a guide to guide us in our children learning about our African American heroes. And we do African dance and hip hop and computer literacy. We just do all kinds of things. So we really need to uh, raise money for our scholarship fund okay. because we have a lot of children in the community that really cannot even afford the, we, we charge $100 a week, which is quite reasonable it really for is. everything. I, that it, we, it, I mean, I know I never, everyone's yes. not in a position to pay that, really. but for what it sounds like the children yes. get. That so this, is, this, this, uh, this event is, uh, is you know, it, it helps us. Uh, accomplish our goal mm -hmm. for presenting uh, community events and uh, giving history to uh, people, uh, especially our young people, because our young people really, really need to learn the history behind our people. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, not everybody came up with the hip hop, not everybody <laughs> came up, you know, on TV. You know, we a lot of people had to pay their dues. Right. And so we, we want to be able to present as uh, they call grown folk music. <laughs> and, um, and at the same time, we're learning some things, we're sharing with the community, and, and all the benefits will help the children to come to this uh, Kwanzaa summer camp. So the benefit, the proceeds from swinging yes. on the Chitlin Circuit yes. go to the Kwanzaa camp. Yes, yes. So do. how can people, so we have two things. We have the yes. swinging on the Chitlin Circuit, mm -hmm. and that's gonna be April 14th. No, no, April 30th. April 30th. April 30th. Um, mm -hmm. And then we have the Kwanzaa camp. Or is that open to everyone? That is open to the community. Okay. Now the Kwanzaa camp actually starts June the 13th and it runs to August the 12th. Okay. So, um, and every Friday after, after we come back from the Easter break, um, because uh, we will be closed. I do the after school program there and we're gonna be taking a little vacation. But every Friday up until May 27th, we will have an open house where people can come and register. And they'll actually get to meet some of the staff there. We'll do a, a um, we'll have projects that uh, we can show what we do. And um, they'll see a, a, a you know, video or DVD of some of the activities because we always give a final performance. And this year, our children are going to um, be uh, taking steel drum lessons from the Grand Opera House. That is amazing. Yeah. I mean, we do great things. People look at us and say, when are y'all going to open your school? <laughs> <laughs> because some of the children, you know, uh, they learn a lot more at Kwanzaa Camp than they do maybe all year long. And, and we teach them things that they wouldn't normally get mm -hmm. in school. 
and we do it in such a way that they don't forget. Right, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Now the Friday open house, is that all day? No, the Friday open house is usually, I timed it so that it's during the time that parents will come to pick up their okay. children from the after school. So it's from 4.30 to six o'clock and that'll be every Friday after Good Friday mm -hmm. okay but you know if they want to call they can call 652-9937 and I'm usually there every day from 1 until 7 or 8 in the evening you know with the after school but and especially now that we're preparing for um, you know this Chitlin Circus swinging on the Chitlin Circus I'm telling you you better come but because friend, it's going to be a a great time. I, I know my mother is sitting at home right now going, Nikki better take me to that. Because everyone outside work, here calls uh -huh. me Nikki. Uh -huh. I know she's at home right now saying, Nikki's going to take me. I'm going to go. So yeah, I'll we're going to have a there. great time. We're going to have, you know, dancing, you know, some dancers. That's because they great. always had a comedian. They had a dancer. And the band was the big thing, you know. And one of the things I've, I learned a lot, because at first the Chitlin Circuit, I just thought it was the Southern states mm -hmm. but it's it was all the east coast and baltimore and washington and even the club baby grand that uh, that used to be here that we highlighted last year was a part of the chitlin circuit the uptown theater in philadelphia so we are going to be up really we're going to be rocking so one more time with the phone number to get mm -hmm. tickets for the chitlin swinging with the chitlin circuit okay you can call 302-652-9937 and uh, someone there in the office will help you. You can leave your name and I'll get back to you. And you can also call uh, Mike Jones at 743-9184. Mama right. Butler, thank you so thank much. Thank you for having no me. No problem. Thank we are you. very excited about this. Yeah. So don't be surprised if you see me and Michael floating oh, I around. I'll be disappointed. <laughs> I'll be dis and I know Michael better show. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're going to ask you at home, too. Please stay tuned. We have more for you. Don't forget, right, right, coming up right next, we have T.T. Monet, our featured You Are Future artist. We'll be right back.